chill, and there is no filter. That's what's up. No chill, no filter. What's poppin', what's poppin', and what is poppin' again, y'all? Y'all know what it is, man. This is your big homie MC Ron Ski. No chill, no filter TV, man. That just had to happen. Boy, I tell you the truth. I just got too much stuff laying around, man. First off, water. Water. Drink lots of it. I'm promoting it. I'm advocating water today. <sighs> Ooh, tastes good, too. Nice and cold. Um, Y'all know what it is, man. I'm here to speak on the UBL Nemesis card. Dude, the name of that, the name of that, that event definitely was on point. Because it was like, yes, this was the Nemesis, for real. These were the people that went up against people. I'm talking about these were like serious chop-ups all night for real for real um i want to just give a quick shout out to my man g gray man and jay lopez jay lopez put the thing together you ubl is the one that brought it to life and for real for real man i'm noticing a lot going on hey g gray you sit up there talking about other platforms <laughs> fam they about to be fighting to get on yours in a minute for real for real dog keep doing what you're doing man i'm proud of really all of y'all with what y'all doing man for real because y'all putting on for the midwest man Man, and I see great things happening. Excuse me. That was just real irritating. Um, yeah, I see I see great things happening for the Midwest, man. And I'm just glad that I can be a small part of it, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, once again, shout out UBL, man. Shout out G Gray. So this is about to be the recap of the UBL event, man. I was supposed to have made the Black Ice event, man. But I was still in recovery. Woo! I was in recovery from the UBL event, man, and I'm talking about it was cracking so hard. I mean, you know, seriously, I definitely, I'm, I'm, I'm very appreciative of the support. On behalf of No Chill, No Filter TV, UBL, J. Curry, Jeffrey, I was finna say Jeffrey Gray, G. Gray, you know what I mean, J. Lopez, Lady Loyalty, you know what I'm saying, showing her support, being the, the, the hostess with the mostest, you know what I'm talking about. On behalf of all of us, man, to y'all, man, we definitely appreciate the love and support that was that was given the night of the Nemesis card, man, for my man G. Gray, man, the UBL event. Happy birthday, well, happy pre-birthday to my man J. Lopez, you know what I'm saying? Still a young homie, you know, although it is your birthday. But yeah, <clears throat> now that I got all of that out the way, we are going to talk about it. And actually, when I say we, I mean Lady Loyalty and I... Um, we definitely did a quick one, you know, so I'm going to give it over to her and myself and then I'll be back, you know, to give a quick commentary on what we probably missed or whatever and then, you know, I'm going to wrap it up and I hope you guys enjoy it. Lady Loyalty, Big Ron, MC Ron, Ski, The OG, No Chill, No Filter TV. Take okay. <laughs> no Chill, No Filter TV, recap of the evening yes. with Lady Loyalty, oh, the beautiful hostess of the evening. Yes. Okay, first battle, we have J Major versus the dude County Line. Yeah. I know. I got Major. And you know what? If Major keep up that type of energy I and keep major. it cracking like that, yeah. he'll be okay. It was actually, I mean, it, in most of his, like, in all, damn near all three of his rounds, he like, Started slow, but once yeah, he, he turned up, up, yeah, he picked up, don't he? He turned up, he and I told him, and see, I like his swag, though. He got a decent ass swag, right? I ain't know that nigga was that damn tall, though. Yeah, he a tall man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know what? And then we go, we just gonna jump right off into the ones that that we can act that that's memorable. Yeah. Um, G Gray, the boss man, oh. versus you know what? That was a bogus battle. Y'all hey, know that. that. Now, you know what's so crazy? Other dude was saying some shit. What's lyricologist? Yeah. I think his name is. He was saying some shit. <laughs> he really was. Mm -hmm. Um, but G Gray. Yeah. The ball. G Gray fan, gangster. Now. Yeah. G Gray. He brought the gangster to Mayberry. Yeah. 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 He, he brought the gangster to Mayberry. Yeah. yeah no. Okay. Uh, you know what? All right. We just gonna just jump off over to your dudes here and fat folks uh okay so okay fat folks choked yeah i mean he choked about two three times yeah he no choked we ain't gonna edit them That's out either normal. yeah so we ain't editing no chokes out right but um the shit that he was getting off it was nice 
nice. It I was. ain't gonna lie. It was nice. It was. But um, I gotta give it to Scotty. Yeah. Um, you spent Scott, some of that Scotty, shit now. Scotty Lyrical. Throw up the dub. Alright, man. You, you don't got to do that. She was on stage like, that's my baby. <laughs> 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 um, you know what, and then, then you know what, honestly, I'm not gonna say what I wanna say yet. I'm not gonna bring up the one I wanna bring up yet. Mm. Let's bring up this last one. Buck versus Emery. <laughs> Fucking on Three the to the O. <laughs> Nigga, 3 O. We already know. And uh, what, what's the dude's name? That he Emery Forbes. Emery Forbes? I do believe that's what his name Look, is. If it ain't, I'm sorry because I don't remember at all. <laughs> uh, but. <laughs> Uncle Buck got clean the fuck off. Yes. That was a three fucking old. That's the old school Uncle Buck. Team Buck, baby. See? Team Buck. But I'm kind of upset at the, the Forbes, dude. Yeah, I thought it was going to be way better. Because he said he was from fucking Baltimore. So yeah. you know I'm thinking print. Yeah. He about to have a good ass accent. Yeah. I ain't hear no use. None of that. None no, of that. Nothing. I don't know now. He probably None tried to that. invent that little. Well, right. Well, you know, he came. He came. He jumped on my uh, my my, re, uh, my prediction vlog. Uh huh. And he was like, "Yeah, man. You know, nice prediction, man. But I'm going. I'm gonna take it." Oh. So yeah. I'm like, I told him, "Look, man. If you gonna make me eat my words, he, he he's took, out of hot sauce." He took it. He took what? He took that ass. Whoop. I was what just gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, man. I know now, what you're gonna say. I already know which one you. Bull, and, and, and this and this gonna be it. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know what? I want to say something about Larry Bull versus Steezy. Uh, Larry. Uh, yes, like I said, Larry got he got that he got that energy. Steezy Steezy kind of lost me. I don't know if he was doing that uh, on he, purpose with he, the choking at the beginning. He, dog, he choked long. Yeah, and then he had the nerve to talk about Mr. Sixteen. Dude, and that was the crazy part because I thought it was like a setup because. I right. Right. Choke so bad. Right. And then once I realized he was actually choking, I don't know if I'm on camera saying it, I'm so sorry if I was, but sometimes words just come out. And right. I just said karma's a bitch. I just really did. So <laughs> I just really did. So it is what it is. Yeah, so yeah, Larry Bull took Larry that Bull. one. I hate that happened because you know, uh, you know, Steezy was on People my top ten. People in 2017. Come back now. We yeah. For him to come back, and he uh, he he upset me. Yeah, he he jacked it. Okay. The battle of the man. Look, man, I'm, look. How did this even happen? Man, look. With Hoodlum versus Vex. How did look, that even happen? I have the slightest. Do you know idea. Vex's last performance? Was so ass, and that was on the Props Battle League. Was it? Yes, it was. Oh. Him versus Great Britain. Oh, see, I didn't watch. Oh, damn! You know what? I didn't watch. I did not even get that choke on my my top ten chokes of 2018. Oh, you tripping? It's I'm choking. bogus. <laughs> I'm super bogus because he choked so bad that I'm talking about his round was probably like a minute and a half, two minutes. He stopped it. He had to stop it. Oh. Okay. And and uh, uh, Great Britain came in and went on here and. And Molly whopped his ass. Okay. But you know what? Vex this evening was he, decent. He, he had he was, he was like you said he was decent. He had some okay shit. I mean that man is sick, twisted, and demented. Yeah, yeah. So if you like that shit, you gonna like his shit. Right, right. But still. Um, but my bro Hula, what my you, nigga. I, I mean, keep it one hundred though. My nigga. Keep it one hundred. This is like pretty much one of the best damn hoodlums. Nigga, the best fucking. That we done seen. That nigga was talking the street shit and also had the bars with it though. So Back in the ass. You do he cut the fuck up. Yes. I'm proud of my bro. He and I'm talking. Look, I had to stop. I had. I, I just went on here. I just stopped recording. What? I, I'm like, look, I'm gonna stop recording because that's it. I don't need no more. Well, no. And like, then I stopped recording too that soon boy because he came in with. The kitchen oh like my a god. Reveal? What? The, the haymakers and room shakers. What? Bars of the night. Yeah. Yeah. Bars of the night. So yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing that battle drop. Yes. Um, I'm definitely gonna watch it on cam, and then I'm gonna do an actual recap on it, yeah. which I really don't have to. But I just need to talk about my manhood. Yeah. He done. He done. He done. Definitely. Yeah. You know, cause cause you know people always talking that oh that's all they talk about is yeah, this that and the third. I don't Look. Give a fuck. If you feel it, you feel it. If you live it, you live it. But no, see, here's the thing. Wait, wait. The cereal <laughs> cold bar. I, oh my. What? Oh, and then, and then, oh my God. What? 
Yeah. Oh, well, okay, so. Yeah. I can talk all night about that motherfucker. I already know. I already know. That, that know. is locked in memory. I yeah. know that motherfucker. He said it one time. Yeah, <laughs> and he acted an ass. You know what? Bottom line is, my dude Hood got off. Yes. It was a, it was a clear. Clear body. Clear. Clear body. Clear. Clear. It, it's clear not, body. Not even debatable. No. Debate no, what? No, nowhere near it. Debate what? Well, which, which, not, hey, okay, nobody. yep, it's a debate in there. It's a debate. The debate is going to be which bar was the hardest. Right. That's what the bar, that's what it's going to be. Debate. Right, right. He got clean the fuck off. He just really did. Yes. Okay, oh. man. Once again, man, it's your big homie MC Ron Ski with Lady Loyalty. No chill, no filter, motherfucking TV, bitch. You damn right, okay. No chill, no filter. <laughs> TV, bitch. Now that we got that out the way, as y'all can see, man, it was a crazy, crazy night, man, for real. Um, all the battles I, I dug, but they were kind of one-sided because somebody came here from Florida also, but I think the Floridian was um, the stamp god who got ducked by the way yeah I think I think that's that's who I wanna who I wanna say um, Steezy you choked so bad fam I don't know what was going on with that um, fat folks I said I said that's not what I'm called lyrics Scotty I'm putting fear in Scotty mm -hmm. hold it down hold it down Fat folks. Fat folks. I, and, I, and I told you, man. I, well, maybe that's what it was. You was just under so much pressure of, you know, having to... And I ain't gonna say prove yourself because who am I, man? I ain't, you know, I'm just, you know, a little old man that's trying to, you know, bring y'all... You know what you what you what you don't cover, what you don't see. You know that's all I am. But you know it is what it is, man. Um, G. Gray, why do people when they just like me they this name? What's lyricologist? Yeah, that <laughs> that was. You know we hate even seeing that name. And you know what, Ruffin versus I want to say Chris Needy. I think that was his name. Um, if I'm not mistaken, Logic Divine had pulled my coattails on that. I'm hoping I'm saying it right, but they not on the card. They wasn't on the card. Ruffin, boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you keep that energy up. Uh, Chris Nitty was, was fire, though. He was... He was fire. You know, y'all gonna have to see that on the... Uh, y'all gonna have to definitely see that on cam. Um, do I got Ruffin winning? I don't know. I will have to actually see that battle again. But because it was one of those battles where, like you said, if you go last, you probably going to get the edge because if you if you throwing enough haymakers, you're going to make people pretty much kind of forget, you know, the first battlers, you know what I'm saying, line. So, I mean, if you forget the first battler's bars, man, then that's an easy win for the person that goes second. And he was fire. I'm, I just, I got to admit it, man. But don't get it twisted, though. Um, Ruffin, for his first battle back, man, since, you know what I'm saying, being incarcerated. Welcome home, by the way, young homie, man. Stay up out of there, man. You know what I mean? We need you here. Being up in there, man, you just, you know what I mean? I, if your existence don't make a difference, you know what I mean? Just... You know, whatever the case, man, just just try to stay up out of that, fam, for real. Just try to stay up out of that. Okay, so on to the next one, man. Jay Savage versus Shooter. They both choked. They both was kind of like, I don't know if you want to say, if I want to say ill-prepared. So that's going to be another one that y'all going to have to really see on cam. Um, I like Shooter, though. You know, shoot, shooter, is a, shooter is a beast, and they put Jay Savage up against the OG. You know what I mean? Shooter ain't no shooter ain't no new dude. He ain't no guy that, you know what I mean, that just came in and, and started, you know, rapping. He ain't one of them cats, and he not no clout chaser either. Speaking of clout chasing, man, this is to really, because I see this too much. Like, you know what I mean? You have a decent battle, Okay. That's it, man. Sit your ass down, dog. All that old, you know, that extra stuff, man, trying to jump all in front of cameras and do all this and, you know what I mean, running all up and, man, dude, you, it, there's such thing as sore winners also, man. Don't be a sore winner because that make you a loser in my eyes. Don't, you know what I'm saying, go to getting all beside yourself because you have a decent battle. And this is to whoever, man, but I'm, I'm just seeing too much of it, especially when you coming off some garbage. You know what I mean? If you, if, and, and, and you need to understand something, consistency is the key. 
Consistency makes you a beast. See, that's what I'm saying about, about you know, people like Coogee, Bankhead, you know what I mean? The example, well, the example, you know, you're only as good as your last battle, but my thing is he has a resume. He has a whole portfolio, you know what I mean? So that stuff there is irrelevant. That man is still, you know what I mean, my top five. Chris Kane, I ain't never seen him choke, you know what I mean? That that's This is what I'm talking about. Y'all need this type of energy. Keep that type of energy, then start to kind of, you know, get your face out there and put your chest and put your chest out and go to beating on it, you know what I mean? But, you know, if, if you just having a decent battle and, you know, and then, you know, you're winning because this person is, and, you know what I mean? That's really not enough for you to just jump up, man, trying to make it seem like you somebody that you're not. So, with that being said, man, that was the recap. UBL, shout out to my man G Gray, man, for that Nemesis card. Um, Jay Lopez, it, you know who, who was it? Man? Well, I, I guess it was Jay Lopez, but you know it was a UBL event. None, all the same. You know they all affiliated, man. I'm, I'm glad I was there. I'm glad I was able to cover what I covered. And once again, man, shout out to my man Hoodlum, man, who had pretty much bar of the night. You know what I mean? Bars of the night man shout out to that dude man and he definitely was a brand new hood man and you know what keep that energy up man and you definitely on your way to url for real for real um once again man it's your big homie mc ron ski man that was my recap of the ubl nemesis card happy birthday you know what i'm saying pre-birthday wishes to my man jay lopez man and many more to you and i look forward to seeing y'all to the next at the next one and i definitely go i'm definitely gonna be there man especially if they're gonna be cracking like the last one and trust me that demonstration was cracking if you missed it you missed out but once again this is your big homie man i'm signing off mc ryan ski the og and there's no chill no filter tv and i'm about this bitch thank you lady loyalty peace